Now, when we look at our the inside of the bone, we'll pass. See if I can break these a couple times. What you're going to see, as we have looked at this morning, I wanted to give you this visual. This rough outer border becomes our compact bone. I should say becomes is our compact bone. And you'll see in, the sh <coughs> in this part of the bone, in the shaft of a long bone like this, there's your medullary cavity, is that pole. And the um, spongy bone <coughs> and the spongy bone is all that trabeculi around it. And the beauty of this is when we get in there, scrape all of that out, that right there, that is your marrow. So in this case, red marrow. We haven't talked about the marrows yet. Red marrow, which you'll find deep inside <coughs> the medullary cavity itself, is aptly named red because what we said the marrow or red the blood bones cells. produce blood cells. So red marrow is going to be your key component for producing the red blood cells. More here towards the epiphysis is you're going to see your yellow marrow. And your yellow marrow, yellow, think fats. It's going to be more of your lipids <laughs> and your fat and cholesterol production as well. So you have multiple layers within there. But that's that's all lining the inside. So if we were to clean this up a little bit, you'll see the white part again is your compact bone. The inside coating, your trabeculi, that becomes your spongy bone. And then inside the cavity itself is going to be your marrow medullary cavity. Does that make sense so far? Well, this one's not going to work as easy because of the density differences. When we look at the epiphysis, what you're going to see is you're going to see a lot more <coughs> of that. Again, the shape, the tunneling, or the passageways, those are your osteons, your tunnels starting to form. And here you can see the thicker outer compact bone, and then this denser stuff is going to be your spongy bone, and you get nice, soft, squishy. But the end, remember, there is no cavity at the, in the epiphysis. That's all spongy bone and the marrow and the fluids that are uh, working its way around. So seeing the concept and the, and the building of our bones on here.